Okay, I want to take a little closer look at this uh, ignition control. This is not an IFC. This is simply a flame safety control. Uh, it starts the uh, hot surface igniter and provides power for the flame rod to sense flame. This is a White Rogers 50E47, which is a fairly common one for the time this furnace was made. Uh, kind of look at a couple of things on it. Okay, these are the hot wires going to the hot surface igniter. There's a switch inside here that turns these on. Here we got a green wire which is grounded to the chassis. It's grounded right down there. Uh, FP is the flame proving. That's the yellow one. Uh, we got an orange wire here that is TH which is thermostats. That's one side of the 24 volt that starts this thing. TR is is common. Uh, that would be for transformer. Now, this is a 24 volt transformer, the common side of the 24 volt transformer. And it also jumps over here to one side of the main gas valve. And then the other side of the hot side of the main gas valve. So quick little sequence. Uh, thermostat energizes the uh, control board through here. Uh, after a pre-purge, this uh, switch closes, starts a hot surface igniter. Uh, main valve is open. There's power passes to the main valve through this yellow wire right here. Uh, flame is proved by the flame proving line. And if flame stays on, it stays on. Now if you look at this thing, it tells most of what you would need to know about it. Okay. Uh, input 25 volt AC. Current gives two tenths of, a, of an amp. Uh, that's for the uh, gas valve. Uh, output is 120, that's for the uh, hot surface igniter. It is a trial for ignition, that's seven seconds. Okay, for seven seconds, it's going to be on. The gas valve will be turned on with hot surface igniter on, on a trial for ignition. Uh, if it does not start, it will pre-purge for 30 seconds. It pre-purges for 30 seconds when it first starts up too. It will start once and then retry twice. And warm-up time for the uh, igniter is 17 seconds. There is a diagnostic indicator. That's a diagnostic indicator. Uh, don't tell a whole heck of a lot. If the red light stays on, replace control. For flashing light, refer to service instructions. Okay, flashing light means it's on lockout. Okay, now you've got your flashing light there. This unit has tried three times and failed to light. So you'll get your blinking code. That's the only blinking code this has. It's a red light. It doesn't look very red light in this uh, camera, but uh, it is a red light and it's blinking like that. And if it's steady, it means the control has internally failed. So that is the 50E47 uh, White Rogers control.